If you provide a customer with a credit note, for example because they've returned faulty goods, you can create this from the original invoice. Alternatively, you can create a standalone credit note and allocate this to any outstanding invoices at a later date. Before creating a credit note, you must first create a customer or supplier record if you do not already have one. In this example, we will be creating a sales credit note for a customer, but the process to create a purchase credit note is the same. To create a credit note from an invoice, go to Sales and Sales Invoices. Then select the invoice you need to credit. Then choose Create Credit Note. The credit note appears with the same details as the original invoice. If you are crediting part of the invoice, you need to change the figures to reflect how much is credited from the invoice. You can add any notes to the invoice if you wish. Once you're happy with the credit note, click Save. If the credit note is for the full amount, the invoice status changes to Paid. If the credit note is for part of the invoice, the status will show as Part Paid. You may not always have an invoice to use to allocate to your credit note too. In this case, you would need to create a standalone credit note. Again, in this example, we're going to create a sales credit note. However, the process is the same if you want to create a supplier credit note. To create a standalone sales credit note, go to Sales, Sales Credit Notes, then click New Credit Note. You can search for your customer by typing their name in the drop down box. This narrows the search down until you find the customer you need. Then, fill in the credit date and any reference that you want to use. If you are crediting a product or service you have a record for, you can add this by using the drop-down menu and the rest of the fields auto-populate with the default information. You can add multiple products or services by clicking on the next line down and searching for the product or service again. If you did not have a record for your products and services, you can enter the information manually for the rest of the fields. You can also enter any notes for the credit note before clicking Save. You've successfully entered a credit note and it remains outstanding until you allocate it to an invoice or a refund is recorded.